Outside Nigeria, former U.S. President Donald Trump arrived in Greenwood, Nebraska for his Save America rally. And Mr. Trump's rally is expected to be in support of Nebraska gubernatorial candidate Charles Hepster. The event was scheduled for Friday, but was delayed because of severe weather in the area. There is more in this report. Nebraska's primary election is on Tuesday, May 10, and Mr. Trump has endorsed Charles Hepster for governor in October. The former president held a joint rally in Nebraska on Sunday alongside the governorship candidate accused of sexual misconduct by at least seven women. Mr. Trump called the allegations against Mr. Hepster malicious, insisting he's been badly maligned and described it as a shame. Senator called Little Ben Sass. The former president also slammed U.S. President Joe Biden on issues around Russia's invasion of Ukraine, hike on oil prices, inflation, among others. You all say we had a great success, Joe Biden, and that's despite all of the witch hunts and hoaxes and everything else we had to go through. And Joe Biden's unmatched and un, really unmitigated failure, because it's been a tremendous, tremendous failure. Let's look at some of the facts, the numbers and the results. It's undeniable. I got gas down to $1.87 a gallon and even lower in some places. Meanwhile, Mr. Trump's bid to shape GOP faces test with voters in May races. A fine man. Donald Trump has so far only endorsed those who corroborate his false claims of election fraud. Now, voters across a dozen states are set to decide primary elections in this month and will determine the people and priorities leading the GOP, leading the GOP into the fall midterms and beyond. It's bad news.